Scared? I'll show you scared. Hand me those acting sticks! So beautiful, but damn! Look at my fucking forehead! Fuck! And, oh! What you say? Queen! What the fuck is this kid doing? The boys are- Sir, will you please stop staring at me? Where's the rest of you? I'm sorry, Cinderella, you can't go to the ball. But I love balls. <laughs> I am on to see my husband. I'm happy. I'm happy to see. This is so sick and fucking twisted. Sick and twisted. You have nothing. I don't have to tell you anything at all. Unless. Unless. <laughs> Neighbor, you like me. That's adorable. Mr. Bombastic Bomba Fantas. The scroll has given him power. I got to get back before Cleveland realizes I'm not in bed. Donna. Donna. Ariana, what are you doing here? <laughs> what are you doing up there? I can't go back to jail. People think my sister is so glamorous, but look at this. <laughs> hey, kitty, how you doing? Meow. You love her? Yes. Are you willing to do whatever it takes to stay with her? Uh, no. Let's see what they're up to. Yeah. Well, yeah. that's that's interesting. I think it's because she gets distracted by shiny objects. No, I don't. Can't handle the uber instincts of my uber autism. Observe. What do you want to be remembered for? Kindness and being kind. Ah. He's got my girl. He's got my show. He's got my merchandising! What happened to him? He died. Would you still love me? Hmm? If what? No, that was the question. How do you keep your pants up when you're performing? It's incredible. Belt. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room, a wooden room, a wooden room with dragons. The dragons made me crazy. Om Nenor. Om Nenor. Om Nenor. Om Nenor. Om Nenor. Om Nenor. Never back down, never what? Never give up. Never back down, never what? Never give up! Why are you walking away from us? Do we embarrass you? Crusty Cray, yeah, yeah! Wally's a furry confirmed? <laughs>
They got girl skateboards. Oh my god. You can skate now. They got gay skateboards. Oh my god. You can skate. We're now. fucking set. Oh, this one looks nice. Can I have it? It really looks you got it from. I'm gonna take it, okay? I just kinda want it. It looks really good. Jesus! You look quite divine tonight. Here I'm on. Know him? He's a new friend. You okay? You know, you could tell me. I'm okay. Oh, I trained her in the car. She's not gonna break. Fingernails, fingernails, fingernails! You don't even have fingernails. <laughs> I cannot believe what I am hearing. Wherever you go, I won't be far to follow. Oh, 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 Don't point that gun in my face! Is you LGD cause your gun pink? <laughs> hey Mater, it's nice to finally be back in Radiator Springs. I want you. What? Do you like waffles? Oh, I don't like waffles. Do you like pancakes? I don't like pancakes. Do you like French toast? Please. Don't you dare disobey me, Caroline! Hot? Color me and treat. He's super hot. He might be your type. Is he daddy? Him? Stomach will thank us. It's apple pie to cider vinegar. <laughs> I like to draw. Really? Yeah. You gotta show me some. No. You gotta show me. No. Come on, let me see. No. All right, I'm gonna show you. I bet, 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 bet. Okay, okay. Huh? There's so many bugs. <laughs> I jumped in front of your picture. Now it's ruined. Bart, this isn't a photograph. I'm not just gonna paint you into my. Oh! What do you want? A chocolate. You want what? What chocolate? Oh, your poor thing. Yeah. Hello, motherfucker. Hey, I'm super, super busy right now. Can I call you right back? She's cool, me, man. Oh, I'm sorry, girl. You gotta stand up or something. You almost knocked me over, Bookie. Here you go. I apologize. You were so good, think of it. Hey, you haven't returned anymore. You anyone? are gay. <laughs> you want a wiener in your mouth? How about a nice big cup of shut the fuck up? Think before you open your stupid mouth, jackass. The difference between the way we treat our friends and the way we treat each other. Get well soon, love Leslie. Miss you, love Bobber. That bus should have ended you. The difference between the way we treat our friends and the way we treat each other. Get well soon, love Leslie. Miss you, love Bobber. That bus should have ended you.
Everybody told me that I sound like CG5. Probably because I am CG5! I am CG5! So sh- Yo, I'm really sorry, okay? What is wrong with you? Why are you blue? That's it. Yes, this is perfect. You just keep looking at me with those pretty eyes. Don't take your eyes off of me. Bro, I just woke up from my dream. Who stole my fucking armor? Get on back. dream who stole my fucking armor get on back Pets? Girls, Girls like, like sensitive, sensitive guys, guys, right? A uh, uh, cat. What is his name? Girls, Girls also, also like, like tough, tough guys. guys. Uh, missile launcher. <laughs> Checking if my Pepadex got rid. Did he make any spelling mistakes? No, but he did say who instead of whom. Call it. I think you'll find it's whom. Quick, block it before he can respond! With the eye. Okay, you want me to call your mother? No! <laughs> it works every time. They're scared to death of her. <laughs> call me for what? Oh, Eva, my love. <laughs> Get with the eye. Okay, you want me to call your mother? No! <laughs> it works every time. They're scared to death of her. <laughs> call me for what? Oh, Eva, my love. <laughs> Working on it. Question. I was wondering, can you shine in the dark? I don't know. Can I? <clears throat> Mark doesn't want you because you're mean and evil. He wants me because I'm nice and sweet and pure. So fuck off. Don't you dare laugh.
Starlight. He is not the love of your life. He's literally just a guy. Hit him with your car. You! What's wrong with me, huh? You don't like me! I like you! What's wrong with you? I'm so sorry, I just had a nightmare. What a beautiful man. Oh, what a handsome man. He's so good looking. Reminds me of my boyfriend. I'm not worried about silly things like labels. People can call me whatever they like. They can even call me Dookie. Never call me Dookie! <laughs> Oh, you're such a handsome young man. Can you give us a big smile? Jake, I never ask you for anything. When did I ever ask you for anything? Yesterday. You said, Jake, please take me to see chips and ice cream. It's a Broadway smash. Are those fairy cakes? Um, yes. With buttercream icing? Yes. Want one? You are not good enough for my daughter, and I don't want you around her. End of story. So why don't you give me one more- Hey, buddy! Squidward! Free cleaning service? Census taker! Good day, kind sir. Would you like to buy some Gil Scout cookies? <laughs> Why you crying? You crying cause Grandpa lost the wallet? Christmas ain't canceled, motherfucker. Christmas ain't ever canceled as long as you know how to steal. Merry Christmas, asshole. Not the solution, not part of the solution. Do you want to come with me to Yes. You didn't let me finish. With you is all I need to know. <laughs> Say that again, I liked it. Um, um. Oh, well, where are you taking me to see the new neighbor? You don't usually do this. But the... Oh, fuck, it's in Korea! Oh my god, Shit. same... <laughs> Let me ask you, what if I offer you something that could change your life forever? I'm taking you home. This is not the way to my fucking house, Kurt. Oh, no, not your home. My home. My home. Now he's six, sit on the curb now with his fix Get a nigga from the six, homeboys pick them up, I'm like Chugga, 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 chug
Please stick your fingers between the bars of my enclosure. Please, 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 please! I promise I won't bite you again, please! I am friendly and entirely non-threatening! Can't kill me! Heroes have moral codes! Who said I was a hero? Yo! Welcome home, Chainsaw Dance Mod. Stay tuned for the final results. You speak when you're spoken to, Dingaling. It's true, though. One of your babies was born on Earth. Are you the ruler of this Earth? How did you know? The quality of your top. Do you love it? I love it. I Can't do negative today. Positive vibes. Positive vibes. A single group of wax-coated pencils is not a threat and can be. Oh God. Oh God, no. I am not trained for this. I am not trained for. Run. A nigga, now he's six. Sit on the curb now with the sticks. Get a nigga from the six. Homeboys pick them up. I'm like. The monster's gone, he's on the run, and your daddy's here. Beautiful, beautiful. What is it you want, Barry? What do you want? You you want the moon? Just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down. Hey, that's a pretty good idea. I'll give you the moon, Barry. Say, Minnie, I've got mistletoe and you know the rules. Uh-uh, I don't think so, Mortimer. Hey, that's mistletoe. You know the rules. Gotta kiss whoever's under it. See? As long as it's not like, like blue or pink, bro. I have feelings for you. I have feelings for you. The feeling was friendship. Hey, is this whiskey or perfume? And apparently, I grabbed it, drank all of it, and said, it's perfume. <laughs> and it was. Look, 
It's Pac-Man. Waka waka. Max, can you pretend like you're Morgan Freeman coming to kill me? <laughs> please, 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 please do that. I can smell you. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, this is my, um, welcome part of AU, it's called, um, Freak Wally AU, and it's, Wally, but he's, like, really sexy and tall, and he's also, like, he's also a se- I just can't seem to get my eyes on you, Fuck you! Wanna break from the ads? Wanna break from the ads? Send in the rednecks, all of them spinning round and round. Everybody ready? The Muppet Glee Club. One and two and. Uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. So something is amiss here. I thought it was lovely. You too, Patrick? Yeah, everybody needs at least one day away from... <laughs> well, glad you had fun. Come on, Pico, what the fuck is wrong with you, man? Kayla said he did like my haircut! <laughs> it can't be that bad, let me just... With your nose? I mean, you talk kind of funny. What's so funny about the way I talk? Well, don't get angry. I don't mind. You don't? Hello? Home. Opening your. Opening your home. Opening your home. Darling from Welcome Home, smash that like button and subscribe, yo. Hashtag, I ate four crowns today. Anyway, um, how do you feel about systemic racism? Hello. Hello. Barnaby. I woke up in a new Bugatti, Barnaby. Help, I don't know where I am. Barnaby! How you feeling? Very frightened. Are you sorry? Are you kidding? What's your statement? All I'd say is, oh my choo choo, jump the track. I'd give my life to bring it back. Sorry. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I I just I wanted to take a video cuz you look so cute, but I I dropped my phone on your face. I'm so sorry. What color are my panties? 
what color are my panties? Mother, are you homophobic? Number one, you're gay. Number two, <laughs> I have a lesbian daughter. Number three, I watch RuPaul's Drag Race. How can I be homophobic, idiot? <laughs> Have you ever had someone in your life who's a horrible singer who's pursuing music? <laughs> but there are people who are so horrible and no one ever just says like, it's not gonna happen for you. I'm gonna break your legs off. <laughs> <laughs> The monster's gone, he's on the run, and your daddy's here. Beautiful, 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 beautiful boy. Look, a hoverboard. Look, the apocalypse. Someone got hit in the boing lines. Hit in the boing lines. Boing lines. Boing lines. Oh. Red light, green light, one, two, three. You're fast, okay? Red light, green light, one, two, three. Ah! Red light. Ah! Then why do you like to stay in there? Frankly, I don't. Haven't, won't, aren't, don't. Is that all you can say? Haven't, won't, aren't, don't. And I said, go away. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut the f Wake up. Huh? Huh? I just murdered your entire family. But but I live alone. Huh? Then who are these people in your house? There's people in my house? Well not anymore! Dumb bitch! You could have died! You're welcome. Simply can't accept such a boast without proof. Oh, I can prove it. Here, here comes Eddie now. Watch this. What do you mean? Mayor you can prove? Paul, I've got oh. mayor here for. Oh no. Eddie, 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 catch me, quick, catch me. Go. Ta da! You removed my what? I removed your right kidney while you were sleeping last night. No, 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 no. Why are you shaking and crying and getting your tears all over my hardwood floors? That's not polite. <laughs> I helped you. You didn't need it. A figment of his imagination, but for days it was persistent and it went. And it got louder. Name three things that would ruin a first date. Uh, <laughs> shitting my pants, saying I love you, killing her. Did this happen? <laughs> Did you shit your pants, say you love her, and then kill her out of embarrassment? You can't marry him. And why not? Because... Because he's just marrying you so he can be king. Outrageous! Fiona, my love, we're but a kiss away from our happily ever after. Now kiss me! Mm. Hmm... Who am I? Husband? Husband. A little louder, I couldn't hear it. Husband. Say it louder. Husband. I said louder. Husband! Wally Animation 3. Esos zapatos no se ven muy cómodos. ¿Qué dices? Oh, los zapatos 
No lo son Pero Ian dice que tengo que esforzarme para ser más alta Pues yo creo que te ves bien tal como eres Let's see, let's see What is something someone could do to make you fall in love with them instantly? Honestly, bro, like eye contact and, and a smile. You know what I'm saying? It's just like the passion in their eyes when they're listening to you speak. Dude, don't look at me like that, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys, I want to introduce you to someone that's very, very special to me. Okay? This is him. Can I talk to him? Yeah, be nice. He's autistic. Uh oh. Nightmare, 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 nightmare! That was a giant cat. But that's impossible, isn't it? It's entirely impossible. You know, I like this hiding place a lot better. They'll never find us here. Scream and run. Hey, who do they think they are? I've given the best years of my life to this place, and they think they can just fire me like that? Like trash? I don't think so. SpongeBob? Is that you? I've been waiting for you, Patrick! <laughs> Can you pass me my blush? Your what? The blush. It's makeup. You know, like what your mom throws at you when the vodka runs out? I never had a mom, okay? Joan, I didn't know. I didn't know. Here are the ground rules. You can punch me, kick me, pull my hair. I am A-OK -okay being stabbed. Biting and scratching are on the table. You can use fire. These are the ground rules? Is there anything off limits? Damn, man. You got something really sick you want to do, huh? We gotta ruin it. It's not America. All I know is it's not red, white, and blue. So we gotta change it. We gotta fix it. Red, white, and blue. What this? Yes, yeah, sure, partner. That's the way to go. Partner, I think I f up. I think I think I made the friend. You dirty bitch! Look what you've done to my penis! They're marigolds! Good God! I think she's right. They are marigolds. I may not know my flowers, but I know a bitch when I see one. Sat here and posed for like 10 minutes. Let me see the product. Okay. Is that me? No, no, it's nice. It's so nice. Oh, I'm 
never looked better. We will miss her so much. And she was so sweet. She was never angry. She was never mean. She always had a nice thing to say. Never negative. Baby, 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 if you really want me, honey, get some patience, baby, then you'll get a taste. I'll be tasty, tasty, I'll be laced with lacy, it's so tasty, tasty, that'll make you crazy. T to the A to the S-T-E-Y fucking tasty T. <sighs> enough of that. Go away, damn you. Oh, you're going to get it now. <clears throat> Since I made this puppet and everybody thinks that Frank and Wally are beefing all the time, some of them remind me when I made my Frank puppet to just make them beat the shit out of each other or like, hold on, y'all. Anyway, <laughs> just remind me to do that, please and thank <laughs> special it makes you feel good all the time all the time all the time even in a place like this where everything's so dark and scary you bet thank you for shopping at walmart your total will be uh five thousand and ninety dollars and fifty six cents do you want a receipt no but can i kiss the employee no what the hell is going on over here joker persona 5 tactic oh sorry boss i just sneezed ha <laughs> ha i'm still waiting shut the fuck up you zest fest you're fired i know Today, I wanted to eat a croissant. croissant. So I went to a place that sells croissant. croissant. And I bought a croissant. croissant. And I returned home with the croissant. croissant. And then I ate the croissant. croissant. I'm trying to get the winner's attention by picking more screws. Why are you working so much? I got something in my eye. I fucking love Tame Impala, man. Did you know that it's just one guy? Hold on, it's Ben. Hello? Hey, man, what's up? Yeah, I, I don't fucking know, man. You called me? Hey, Ben, do you listen to Tame Impala? Bro, I'm just so litty off this fire zaza you gave me. I'm seeing colors and shit, man. I sold him an eighth of oregano. Listen to this fucking Joe, shit, man. Ben, if you had to guess, how many people do you think are in this band? Here's your goober meal, sir. Uh, I'm supposed to get a toy with this? Thanks. <sighs> I'm gonna head home, Pat. The celebration's off. Um, are you sure? Yeah. I'm not in a goober mood. Okay. See ya. And here's your triple gooberberry sunrise, sir. <laughs> Yum. You're here! Good noon! Yeah, I'm not a morning person either. I just woke up. Oh my god. Late. Jesus! You get to wake up? Yeah, Another one of those days. It's like a 40 hertz voice. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like, like, like shortwave radio. It sounds like spoken <laughs> brown note. Lily, like <laughs> I, this is me when I wake up. That's what I mean. Oh my god, I'm scared.
Excuse me. Can I get a couple ice cubes in here, please? Sure. A couple of ice cubes coming up. Here you go. Thanks. Uh. Huh? Nunca se rapen, Minion, nunca se rapen, qué horrible. Miren esto, están viendo, tengo la cabeza de huevo. Supuestamente el rapar me iba a mejorar mi cabello, me iba a ver más regia. Falso. Tengo los pelos de clavo. Siento que con esta cabeza puedo rayar queso. Estoy furiosa. Extraño mi cabeza Steady. I'm just a triangle trying to save you from the delusion society gave you. Gravity's a lie, so is the sky Trust in the all-seeing, all-knowing eye Stonefish that kind of look like a rock. You yeah, could shoot enough poison to kill an entire football team in half a second. She kind of reminds me of one of those. Hey, Zane. You're dry. That must feel different. Yes, actually, it did cross my mind. Then I thought, oh no, no, she hangs around with you, her standards must be pretty low. I changed my name and moved to the country. But that's just me. Shots fired. Да, 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 Где мои яйца? Все есть! Где мои яйца? Где мои яйца? That will be twenty-two dollars and fifty cents. Twenty-two fifty? That's insane! Jack. What? It's not even a meal. I mean right now at my place you can pick three for three. People can pick three tasty items, including my new fries, and fill up for just three bucks. Oh, you're just a big softy. Nah, I'm still sad about the popcorn. Coming in! Oh, the door hurt me, Joey! Here, let me do it. Me, me, me. Getting so hot, I don't know if I'll make it. Me, 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 me. It sure would be nice if my friends showed up to help. <laughs> okay, seriously, where the hell are those guys? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm looking for my friends. I'm looking for you. There's Gabriella. Watch what I can do. La la woo. La la woo. Oh yeah. Wow. I'm looking for my friends. I'm looking for you. Hey, there's Gerald. Yeah. Check out my moves. I'm a rock star. Where are you? I left early? Sorry, I couldn't stay longer. Sad face. What the fuck? Where are you going? I'm going home. Are you kidding me? Come back, you're drunk. Don't worry, I called an Uber. We drank at your place. Oh.
Where am I going? Wow, seriously? Get the driver on the phone. <laughs> Back in my lair once more. <laughs> How many times are you going to run? I've captured you 17 different times. I feel like it's going to be at least 18. <laughs> <laughs> Capacity of this bitch. <laughs> run and run. I am an alpha male gamer. Here you are on a boat, you're adrift, you're afloat, one might even say you're stuck. Well, I don't want to gloat, but I would like to note that you're in luck. You've been saved by the ape that rules these waters, so forget about your wives and daughters. First mate, introduce me to them, please. Aye, aye, Captain Gut. He's the big and scary, elegant and hairy, fear inspiring, yes, <laughs> retiring, losing, stealing, but not appealing, undisputed master of the seas. Oh, jeez. Hey, uh, thanks for letting us in, Julie. Yeah, you're right, neighbor. It does smell good in here. Oh, strawberry shortcakes? I would love to try some. Mm. Yeah, I bumped into our neighbor outside after they mowed the molly. Seemed a little bit shaken up. Yeah, that's what I told him, too. Just one of his wacky days. Oh, these are delicious, Julie. How many more of these do you have? I might have to take the whole batch home. <laughs> Hello? What? You are autism? Ha, ha, ha. That's good. I'll tell home. Home. I'm on the phone. They're autism. I told home. Goodbye, autism. I love you. Let me enter your reality. You've got mail. You've got mail. You've got mail. You've got mail. It's just entered my brain and now you'll have to pay him. Always does it for me. Why does Mac peel your apples for you? He doesn't like for me to eat the apples with the skin on it. He says the skin's loaded with toxins. Okay, well, good news. Mac's not here. Well, I know he's not here, and that's why I need you to do it for me. Please, please. Oh, Jesus. Just eat it with the skin I on it. I do not like it with the skin, Dee. I'm not allowed to eat it with the skin. I'm not allowed. Oh, my God. All right. 
If you just shut up, I will peel the apple for you the way that Mac likes you to eat it. Give it to me. Give it to me. I'll do it the way that Mac insists. Okay? Yeah. I why the diddly darn am I dressed like that? So you gonna move? I'm not bossing you guys. <laughs> Holy step. Holy cow! Turn into a holy cow. Yo, we're going into the slideshow. Put me in slide 15, please. If we're talking about how pretty his outfit is, then yes, he slayed that. No. Number one. Meow. Kid number two? Meow. Kid number three? Meow. Kid number, kid number four? Yo. Kid number five? Meow. Kid, kid number 6.9? Meow. Kid, kid number seven? Meow. Kid number eight? Meow. What is the Tickle Tickle Skin? Zizi. That's it. Now you're not getting it for that. Can you not? I'm not getting it to you for that. Are oh, you gonna make me scream loud as fuck? Yeah, more. I guess I am. Do it. Yeah. Get louder. Cause I'm not. Yeah. I blame this. I blame this motherfucker. Quick recap. This is Welcome Home, and the creator explicitly said, do not draw NSFW in my character. And I don't think they were comfortable with shipping either. Now it's not Clown's fault. Tell me why there's now a whole crusade on shipping. I have people in my comments telling me, you can't ship this. And this will be the ship? Um, the age gap is too large. I swear it stems from this. This whole crusade on shipping comes from these Welcome Home fans who want to be Mother Teresa. Girl, you're not helping anybody. Again, clown, have your boundary. I'm talking to the fans here. Y'all only get title of like terrible fandom because you want to be saints. At least these people are loud and proud about their crazy. Some about y'all, this whole purity complex. Leave me out of it. joke? What do you call a body with no nose? Nobody knows. Ex-boyfriends, collect them all. Kyle, beautiful eyes, great sense of humor. Belonged to a weird cult and would always talk about the weird cult and eventually you realized he wasn't your boyfriend at all. He was just trying to get you to join his weird cult. Brad, aspiring musician, forgot your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> was secretly several dozen weasels in a human disguise. Chaz, unemployed, <laughs> slept on an air mattress. Claimed he wasn't the Rat King, but then one night you followed him into the sewers and he sat down on a makeshift throne and a bunch of rats surrounded him and he definitely said, I am the Rat King. Mitch, never paid for you. <laughs> Feared commitment. Said his favorite movie was The Godfather, but it was actually Ice Age 3, Dawn of the Dinosaurs. Do you know what sound it makes? I hear it every night. You can hear it too if you listen. Especially if you wait next to your window. First, there's a rustling in the bushes. Then, the scratching on the pavement and the walls as it crawls up. Finally, if you're quiet, you can hear its guttural sound. I'm not her friend. I'm just her sister. Ugh. Julie is not my friend. 
she is my sister. Is it just me, or does Wally seem kind of off today? Ugh, I guess. Ugh, whatever. Ugh, once again, nobody listens to Fanny. I can't fucking take it! I see an image of a random object posted, and then I see it. Fucking see it! Oh, that kind of reminds me of Amori! It started as, That's funny! That's a cool reference! But I kept going. I see an instrument that reminds me of Amori. I see an animated girl that reminds me of Amori. I go outside the touch grass, but the plants remind me of Amori! It's torment, psychological horror! I'm being conditioned to laugh medically anytime I see a fucking staircase! I can't fucking live like this! I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't! And don't get me fucking started on the words! I'll never be able to hear the word something without thinking about Amori. I'll never be able to hear the word clothes without thinking about Amori. Google tells me the weather today is sunny and I fucking think about Amori. I could watch someone I love jump off a fucking building and all I would be able to say is Hi, my hair is the same. You lied to me. You deceived me. You tried to deceive me. I'm tired of listening to you. You gave me your heart, you know. You'd like me to hand it back whole again, but I won't. You will live a long time yet, Catherine, an eternity without me. You will look into the faces of passers-by, hoping for something that will, for an instant, bring me back to you. You will find moonlit nights strangely empty, because when you call my name through them, there will be no answer. Always your heart will be aching for me, and your mind will give you the doubtful consolation that you did a brave thing. You dare to talk of bravery. What else do we have to talk about, Catherine? Okay, it's been 20 minutes. Beatrice, what did you get for number one? Um, I got 10. That's wrong. No, it's not. Okay, Emily, what did you get? I got 11. What a dumb bit. Beatrice, stop. I forgot how to divide. I got 11 too. Exactly, beat rice. Ms. Johnson, I got 10. I also got 10. I'm the smartest person here, so. No one gives a shit. I don't know how to do this. Ava, what did you get? I couldn't even solve it because why is there a bunch of letters next to the number? Just say you're stupid. Jessica, do you want me to beat your ass? Is the answer 10 or 11? I'm confused. Hmm, Olivia, wanna show your answer? Uh, give me a minute. She's erasing it! Just say it! I got 865. What the fuck? She needs to go back to third grade. Beatrice, you got held back four times, I wouldn't be talking. Damn, four times? Olivia, you're like way off. Your face is way off, how about that? Olivia, can you explain how you got that? I'm too lazy, so no. Class, Olivia is the only one that got the answer right. How the fuck? <laughs> In an anime ships, part one. No comments, zero out of ten. Now if you ship this, no worries, I'll pay you the cost of therapy. 1 out of 10. Next. Uh, if you ship this, come here, give me a hug. 10 out of 10. Literally one of my favorites. <laughs> 0 out of 10. 8 out of 10. I love this one. But I see them more like besties than lovers. But they say it's always bros before. <laughs> <laughs> Please say something. Uh, this one. If you ship them, take it. No, no, no. This one is kind of small. <laughs> this one. You okay with it? Let's get married, bestie. Ten out of ten. Duh.
not on the family? They're not your family. I mean, uh, family of the person that I'm based on? Your grandpa also liked to feed birds. Yeah? Yeah. He fed quail. Yeah? What are quail? They're like the crows you feed, but shorter and pudgier. Hey, listen, um... Yeah? We can't keep meeting like this. But you'll still talk to me, right? I'm not even supposed to be in this county. But you'll still talk to me, right? Yeah, we'll talk. fucking hilarious about beta wally's design specifically <laughs> there's this there's this fast food place that i really like going to it's called hot dog on a stick and and the uniform look at that oh my god do you see how fucking like similar like you would just take away the white strip in the pattern and it would be the same thing this bitch would be working a nine to five Wait, imagine, imagine you're just, like, going to the mall one day, and then you see that. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know why this is so funny to me, but it is. It's so funny. Bro, I probably would, like, taking an order, if, if I was in this situation, taking an order would be the last thing on my mind, because I would just be like, what are you, <laughs> like, what, 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 are, what are you doing here? Beta Wally from Welcome Up. He's all like, yes, it's me. Beta Wally. Common. Oh, YN. You... Oh. Oh, my. Oh, someone's being fancy today. Really, though, what's the occasion? Hmm. Well, what's up with the fancy suit? Yes, I'm staring. I've never seen you in a suit before. And if I'm being honest, you look really good in it. Did I say that out loud? Shit, I said that out loud. Ah, uh, you didn't hear a single thing. If you tell anyone about that, I swear I will throw you into the grinder. Yeah, good. Now... Please, I'm really wondering what what is the occasion? Why why this? You just want okay. Of course you just wanted to see what my reaction was. I should have just guessed that in the first place. Alright, well, if that was all, shoo, you have work to do. Doing voices I think would match Sally Starlet. I'm over the stars for you. And maybe the moon, too. <laughs> You're asking me about stars? Well, silly, I am a star. So here's an interesting fact, actually. Do you know some stars are bigger than the actual sun? Yes, I know. That is super impressing. I know. I got it myself. Come on, come on, and watch the Sally Starlet do the best gesture in the entire world. I knew it. You've been asleep all day, haven't you? What do you think? I say this has got to be Julie's most stellar hairstyle yet. 
<laughs> Arson. <laughs> I like my hair poofed up. Do I have a sibling that's a moon? I actually don't know how to answer that, really. I think you're quite cool, Superstar. But the show's just about to begin, and I already see you. <laughs> yes, Julie! I'm so happy you're here today! I'm so happy to see you too, Sally! It's just a great day today! There can only be one Superstar here. To be or not to be? What about bees? That's a question. Oh, me to be such a star and only be runner-up? Alas, they must be too blinded by my light in order to see how talented I am. Look up, look up. You see that? Those are my parents. Well, I guess they're my parents. The other stars are like family to me. I really do miss them. Anyways, I hope you guys like this one. I really do like Sally. Apple boy, where are you? Huh? Ha! <laughs> Found you! Papador boy, finally gave up? <laughs> Man, you look terrible. Was it something I did? Of course it's something you did. Ever since you arrived, you made things worse for me. You don't even realize that, don't you? Mm. Mm. All I ever wanted was to keep them happy. Keep them safe. Hmm. Keep them safe? From who? It promised me that if I was obedient, I could have a happy life with my friends. Hmm. You know it's only using you, right? Look, it's not gonna be easy, but you can get rid of it. And still huh? have what you want. You know, I got here from somewhere else. I only decided to stay because it's so fun here. If I was able to get in, is home that powerful? H how did you... Shh. It's getting late now. Gotta go. See you later, shrimp. understand why everyone is worried, but with how they're acting, we're not going to get anywhere at this rate. Molly's locked himself inside of home. Eddie and Frank are basically being worried parents, just like Poppy. Eddie has gone out to look for neighbor again. Sally and Julie are trying to stick together to keep each other calm. I guess they're all worried, but if we keep just acting so frantic like this, we're not going to get anywhere with finding them. <sighs> Neighbor, where did you go? What happened? Did you leave? Were you kidnapped? God, if you could have just left us a sign of something instead of nothing at all. It would have made things so much easier. I can only hope that you are okay. I need to keep everyone calm. Alright. I need... I need to sleep, if anything. But I need to go check on Wally first. I know how hard this has been on him. <sighs> well, to see Wally I go. Hey! Hey! Oh, I'm coming! Just be a sec, I'll be right there! Oh! No! Oh! No, no. Oh! Oh! Good not alive! Oh, I really ought to look where my feet are going, huh? Oh, hold on, buddy. These are yours. I'd forgotten I'd had them to give them out to you. Thank the stars I hadn't dropped nothing fragile. <sighs> Shooey! I ain't had no idea how late it gotten. I'm plum tuckered after all this running around. It ain't even the first time I fell today. Ran into a 
few buildings on the way here, too. You know how Julie likes to do her drawing on the sidewalks and all? Well, she drew up a hopscotch on the curb this morning, and I just couldn't help myself. I had to just have a hop, skip, and a jump to start my day. I really am accident prone, I figure, because my face ended up meeting the pavement. <laughs> I may have been a racket today and tossed around, but I'm still fair to middling. Even after that bowling ball order. I suppose I don't got much more running left to do today, though. Unless you got something for me to carry for you. Is there any leaded package or parcel you need me to run for you? Uh, wait, wh what are you looking around me for? Mailman! man! Uh, you uh, got any packages for little old me? My kazoo collection should have been in my mailbox today. Where is it? Uh, uh, um, now, Barnaby, you know better. I have to put it in your mailbox. It's policy. You know a dog like me doesn't do policy, pal. <laughs> the only policy I follow is the greed all dogs follow. Chase in your local mailman. No, oh, I hate that policy. I'll beat you to your mailbox lickety split. If I don't split my lickety. <sighs> I was this close to dogpiling him. Next time, don't give Eddie any hints, eh? Which is why the pie charts must be Breen Berry. Mr. Deer, write that down. Breen Berry. Uh, uh, you, you know, Julie... Uh-uh. President Joyful. Right, right, right. Pr President Joyful. I, I don't think Breen Berry's a real berry. I mean, shoot, what color even is Breen? That's classic. Mr. Deer, that's why they pay me the big shimulas. The whip now? I ain't getting paid in anything, let alone sh shimu sh 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 shimu what, what would you say again, President Joyful? Shimulas, doubloons, smolians, dinner rows. Can't you see what this company is all about, Mr. Deer? Uh, Breen? No, it's about pie charts, big buildings, hot cakes, small stuffed bears, chalk and houses. I don't think any of those things go together, quite frankly. It's about big suits and big hair and big voices. Mr. Deer, are you not confident in our business model? You have good shoulders under your head, Mr. Deer. I would hate to see you canned. C can me? B but you can't fire me. It's my first day on the job. Then you'd better straighten up and fly down, Mr. Deer, because the most important part of running a business is... <clears throat> hmm. Hello, President Joyful of Everything Incorporated. What? Mr. Billy Nilly, no! We've... We're broke? They've eaten all our office supplies! Even the staplers? We're out of business! No! <laughs> this was all I had! Whether letter or parcel, whether ranch no up... Uh, I mean, joyful residents, who may I ask is calling. Oh, barn! Good to hear from you. Yeah, we're playing business or something or other. Yep, yeah, I'd say we're fresh at it. Whatever we're supposed to be selling. I think this time it was Breen. Oh, yeah, he's right here. Phone call for you, woman. My tomatoes alone, and who am I to shoo them away? Isn't a beetle just as permitted to partake of my plans as I am, Julie? Positively, accidentally, Frank. But I've taken such good care of them. I read to them every day. I water them the perfect amount. Oh, you do. You pour a whole book on them and read them the water on their little heads and everything. <laughs> Julie, I'm serious. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Frank. I'm only teasing. You know, if this is bothering you so much, you should have a little sign just for those bugs. It can say, Terrific Tomatoes. Look, but don't touch. <laughs> what <laughs> makes you think they're going to be able to read all that? Well, they've got big, beautiful eyes, don't they? Like big old saucer plates. Oh, Julie, don't be so rude. You wouldn't like it if they said that about you. Said a lot about me. How lovely my hair is. That I put just the right amount of polish on my horns. Oh, more like that Julie Joyful with her nose like an orange. Oh, if they said that, they'd also probably say, Oh, that Frank Frankly with that banana on his face. 
Banana? <laughs> well, if they're going to be so rude in my garden, maybe it's best that they don't get to partake of any more tomatoes then. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> hmm. Well, how are we going to keep him out? Maybe Howdy's got something in his shop. Oh, Howdy is more inclined to sell us canned laughter than he is to sell us something actually useful. Besides, I don't think he likes my rendition of a flea and a fly. No, oh, don't you fret. I'm sure we can come up with a wonderful joke between the three of us. Isn't that right, mm -hmm. So I tells him, I'm just pulling your leg. Boy, you should have seen him home. I had the poor guy's head turn like a merry-go-round. Yeah, he's a real sourpuss. No wonder Julie can't tell a good joke. She's got a sense of humor only Frank could love. Did I tell you that joke she gave me? Something about a three that won? I ought to be a good Samaritan and teach her a thing or two about puns. What? You didn't like that one? I came up with that on the fly. That ought to be worth something. Yeah, speaking of flies... I know he's going on and on about his family today. The poor guy's got more family members than the caterpillar's got legs. And if I'm going to Howdy's, it's at least four. Hey, unless he's walking around on all fours like moi, then I don't count arms. That reminds me, hey, he's been getting better at running. Especially for a guy that's only got two legs. Still scares easier than my mama, though. And she's a real chicken. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, I chased them down for a good reason. My kazoos were supposed to come in today. Which they didn't. And if you think about it, I'm the poor guy that deserves an apology here. I ran after that mailman all through the neighborhood and with nothing to show for it. Yeah, yeah, real funny. A poor little guy like me deserves some sympathy. A clown without a kazoo is like... Like an artist without his paintbrush. Go on, get down. Hello? Buddy? Bell? Hey, you stopped painting. Everything all right? <laughs> So my brother Charlie tells my sister Dolly that our brother Barley's cousin Henry is turning over a new leaf. But if you ask me, Bon, a caterpillar is always turning over leaves. We just call it a salad. So you don't believe the poor guy? Sounds like you're just giving him the short end of the stick. Short end of the... We've given that clown the whole branch. So he's a clown too? Now you're speaking my language, Audi. You wouldn't believe what happened next. My brother Chuck wished our brother Buck good luck on getting that clock Henry to straighten up and fly right. Fly? Wait, wait, wait. He's a butterfly. I thought he was a caterpillar. <laughs> You're being a wise guy, Bon, but I'm serious. Then you're not going to believe this. Out of the blue comes our sister Sue and her brother Drew, talking to my sister Dolly about getting Henry on a trolley to see Aunt Molly. Wooly ain't Molly. Wooly Aunt Molly, Bon. On my father's left-hand side. My left, not yours. Maybe my upper left-hand side. Oh, well, how could I get that confused? But long story short, Molly tells Henry to listen to our cousin Barley and my brother Charlie, who insists they're through with my sister Sue and her brother Drew, and to get back on that trolley and talk to Dolly about getting his act together. Oh, brother. No, no. Holly's my sister. <laughs> I know I can always talk to you, Bon. I tell you, having a big family ain't easy. Too many things to keep track of. You're right about that. I'm just listening in, and I can barely keep track. The only family I gotta keep track of is my dear sweet mama. That's right. 
you know, next time she comes around, you ought to let me serve her one of my strawberry soda pops. Nobody makes them like you do, pal. Uh, speaking of which, how's that drink treating you? Oh, good morning, Ryan. What are you doing? Ah, sir, do you I'm sorry, you what? What did you just say? What language is that? What are... Did, that's not English. What? Uh huh? I still can't understand what you're saying. Maybe write it down. I still don't understand. Proceste was just yes. What? Wait, wait, where where are you going? Okay, then. Oh, you're back. And you brought your friend. Wait, are they going to, like, translate what you say? Because that would be very helpful right now. Da, it'll tak. Yes, that is exactly what I'm going to do, is what they were about to say. But you can't understand them because they will be speaking Russian the entire day. I'm sorry, why are they speaking Russian all day? Why? What? Where did this come from? Why? I didn't even know they knew Russian. Well, because somehow they forgot English for the day. I mean, I hope it's just the day. We're, we're saying it's just the day because we're hoping it's just the day, but we don't know how long it will be. Uh, and their native language is Russian, so they're going to be speaking it. And they taught me some of it, so I can understand the majority of what they're saying. Luckily. Yeah, my Google for it. Sure, but he can't understand you. Just go for it. Jesus Christos. They said Jesus Christ. Anyway, we should probably go get oh, all that work paperwork you have to do go get that done and you're gonna need my help to write it in english because you have you need you, you need help you need my help all right uh sir we'll see you later um please wish me luck with this one oh this is gonna suck yeah you guys go do that <sighs> God, I hope this ends soon so I can understand them again. Bye, What? They said bye, sir. Oh, uh, bye. Hello? 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 Ha, 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 ha. I'm only kidding. I know you're there. Did you like my joke? I think you were going to say yes. <laughs> it's hard to hear you think through this funny phone. Very fuzzy. A little like me. Speaking of, do you know who I am? Oh no. Well, that's not neighborly at all. We've never met before. Don't worry though. You and I haven't spoken. But I have seen you whenever you've looked into my eyes. What did you see when you did? <laughs> I hope you saw a friend, but I'm not sure you saw a name. Sit still. Let's start over. Ring. 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 Click. 
Hi, I'm Wally. I'm so happy to finally meet you. I think you're the absolute most. Uh-oh. I have to go now. Everyone is probably thinking about their strange phone call. What fun to talk about. Don't worry though, neighbor. It will be a little joke between you and me. They're not ready to meet you yet. Remember, until you hear me again, keep your smile merry and always know that I love you very much. Goodbye. That's not neighborly at all. We've never met before. Don't worry, though. You and I haven't spoken, but I have seen you. Whenever you've looked into my eyes. What did you see when you did? <laughs> sure you saw a name. Sit still. Let's start over. Ring. 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 Click. Hi, I'm Wally. I'm so happy to finally meet you. Absolute most. Uh oh. I have to go now. Everyone is probably thinking about their strange phone call. What fun to talk about. Don't worry though, neighbor. It will be a little joke between you and me. They're not ready to meet you yet. Remember. Until you hear me again, keep your smile merry and always know that I love you very much. Goodbye. Oh, just wonderful. Oh, you sound like you have a lot going on in that neighborhood. That's a... Uh... Welcome home. Yes, yes, all oh, that beautiful world. Welcome home. Oh, since the show's really taken off, Wally, I'd say you're quite the popular character now. I am. You are. I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yes. And you're quite a little charmer, too, from what I heard. You're not so bad yourself. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. Hey, that's exactly it. Is that why they call you Wally Darling? They call me Wally Darling because that's my name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true. That's true. You know, you're very beloved by a lot of different people now. Do you find yourself in any sort of romance? 
you've got a lot of friends in that neighborhood. In fact, I think you said you brought one in for us to meet. Is that right? Yes, it's my best friend. He's my neighbor, too. His name is Marty. Marty B. Beagle. <laughs> hey, oh, 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 hello. How are you doing, Rick? Barnaby B. Beagle. Mr. Beagle, a pleasure to have you here. Hey, enough with the formalities. Beagle is my mother's name. Just call me Barn. Oh, is that right? She was a dog, too? Oh, no, no. She's a chicken. You might have heard of her. She's a real famous lady. She crossed the road once. She crossed the road. What for? To get to the other side. They're still talking about her to this very day. <laughs> well, oh, to this very day. Wally, you certainly live amongst a colorful array of characters. It's no wonder you've come into stardom recently. So how are you two handling the attention? I've been destined for show business since I was just a puppy. Who wants a couple more eyes to the well-known comedian like me? As long as they're not throwing tomatoes at me, it sounds like a walk in the park. I tell you, we got a neighbor who's got an arm like a professional baseball player. It's not easy. Oh, <laughs> well, I've ducked a few tomatoes in my own time. Uh, it sounds like a handful, Pon. What about you, Wally? What do you think of all this newfound fame? I think it's just the most. Neighbor? Neighbor, come on. Um, look, about the whole situation, look, it's nothing to be, you know, afraid of. <laughs> Why, it's just some banter that me and Opposite have, that's all. You know, you really don't sound very convincing. You, you shut, shut the fuck up. up. This, this is, is your fault. fault. How is it my fault? You're basically the one that's basically obsessive 24-7. You creep them the fuck out. Huh. That's rich coming from you. Always so aggressive and always so straightforward on things. You don't know when to lighten up thing, now do you? At least I don't terrify them by your weird oddly giddy gaze. You're practically creepy enough as it is. Look, don't do this right now. Neighbor, come on. Look, I know things may seem a little... Complicated at all? Complicated? Yeah. You think this is complicated? You trying to be reasonable here and sound very convincing right now? It's not doing it. You don't sound very convincing at all. You know, there are times where I want to be able to crack your throat. What's stopping you? It'll prove my point on how much you can't be trusted. You're one to talk opposite. Don't you fucking dare. What? You and I float the same fucking boat here. If anything, you and I know what goes along, right? I'm nothing like you. I'm not obsessive and always jealous 24 fucking 7 to the point where I have to kill someone just to prove a point. I do it for a reason. Yeah, you do it for a reason, and it's very, very pointless. At least I do it in a much more reasonable way. You do it spite out of your own sheer will. You do it because you don't like when others give attention to the neighbor, and if anything, you don't like it when someone takes them away from you. Admit it. You're jealous all the time, not to mention obsessive extremely you hate the thought that someone would actually take them away from you no don't you don't make me say it again on you shutting the fuck up i could blink you out of existence if i wanted what's stopping you you're 
right. What is stopping me? But you know what actually is right now? Neighbor. I care about them. Oh, do you know? Yes, yes I, I do. do. I care about them a lot more than you do, opposite. Oh, please. If anything, I do the much more of, like, caring for them than you do. You practically hover over them like a creepy stalker. Am I or am I not wrong? Yeah, that's what I thought. May I give you a second-hand reminder that if you even so much as do a single thing, that all goes to show that you are no better than I am. You are nothing but a walking murderer, willing to do whatever it takes for them to see you and only you, to talk to you and only you, to breathe the same air as you, and it's so unfortunate that they have to go through this every time when they come across you. And I feel bad. I really do. To think that you of all people will actually stoop to this type of level to actually go such great lengths. And I thought I have a bad, but you have worse. You're pathetic. Willing to kill someone spite out of your own jealousy and your own pathetic obsession. You're nothing but a coward. That's what you are. A walking, breathing, blue-haired, side-eyed cross Muppet that decides to become a psycho and kill everyone one by one. So tell me, are you satisfied with yourself? Because if anything, you shouldn't. <laughs> oh boy, I've been wanting to say that all day today. I should kill you right here, right now. Oh, do it. So that way, the neighbor can see on how much you're a monstrosity you are. Because if anything, it'll prove that I'm right about you. Now listen, unlike me, at least I do it for a reason, for a cause. Just to make sure that they stay safe. Just to make sure that they are number one top priority be protected. But unlike you, you do it so differently that you're basically considered creepy at this point. Considered to be unfit to be around them. <laughs> oh boy. Say one more fucking word, I swear it. What? <laughs> at this point, you wouldn't even want to touch me at this point knowing that I'm right. You're just another problem in the mix. You desperately want to kill me, but yet you can't because you're trying to prove a good example. But you failed miserably. <laughs> you... are sick. Very... sick. Twisted... psycho. Oh, come on with your bullshit. If anything, you would have done the same goddamn thing. If anything... You have already done it. Knowing me too, I did it as well. So don't you call me a psycho when you are one, your own damn self. Uh-huh. Sure. <laughs> You're so pathetic. All the cracks are revealed. And look at you. You're practically ready to kill me. Aren't you, short ass? It's, it's fine. fine. It's, it's fine. fine. How was it fine? Because neighbor jumped out the window not too long ago and left. What? Looks, Looks like, like we're, we're gonna, gonna have, have to have, have a little chase. chase. And to see who catches them first, wins, wins over neighbor. neighbor. Because knowing you opposite, you have cruel tendencies like I do. And you're right, you and I are different. Hmm. Now let's go catch him, okay? I'll, I'll make a head start. <laughs> this... is war. Hmm. Kinda have to poo. I think I can make it. Don't worry. 
You have plenty of time. This is not urgent at all. We have to go now. Wait, 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 what? Wait, I, I thought you said we had time. Nope, I lied right now. We have to go now. Wait, wait, there's no time. Wait, I'm not ready. It's coming out. It's ready. Please, please. We're like five minutes from my house, please. You have three seconds. Wait, please, no. Oh, I came out. This has to be the funniest anime ever made. Why? Why does the sun keep rising? I may be alone, but I don't think that makes me some kind of antisocial creep who's failing in life. You're all still young, which means you're fueled by pure, genuine enthusiasm and curiosity. But what grown-ups need is... Positivity. That word means pretending it's okay when it's not. Staying productive and profitable. It's psychological conditioning, which also starts with P. How's your relationship with God? Non-existent. I did a whoopsie doodle and tried to sleep without any pills or booze. What's something you have when you're a kid, but you don't get to have when you're a grown-up? Terra Garden! New Year's money! The tricycle! Mm-hmm. Good job! Everybody's answers are right so far, but I bet you've still got a lot more, yeah? Freedom. Sense of joy. A future. All correct answers. <laughs> it's Tomoki-kun, right? Did you trip and fall? That must hurt, huh? Okay, let's get your mind off it, pal. What happened to my smile and my will to live? Where are they now? Gone. And if you're gonna call me cute, then you bet. You, um. Mm -hmm. Stop. <laughs> You know, you just need to relax and stop overreacting. Murdered this man. Yes. You tortured him. Of course. You know I pulled you over? I don't know, did you already forget? <laughs> Get out the car, spread your butt cheeks. সামনে পরীক্ষা আজকে মোমবাতি যত সময় জ্বলবে তত সময় আমি পড়াশোনা করব বিসমিল্লাহ বেশ আলহামদুলিল্লাহ Go, 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 go! 
Well, I hope you're here to apologize. Ah! No, no, no! Put me down! Stop it! No! Me? No! Ah! Me? Him? Ah! 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 <laughs> from chasing this bad man all over the place. Excuse me? Nobody appreciates you, do they? Do they? Oh, come on. He's a bad horse. Oh, he's nothing but a big sweetheart. <laughs> Isn't that right, Maximus? You've got to be kidding me. Look, today is kind of the biggest day of my life. And the thing is, I need you not to get him arrested. Just for 24 hours, and then you can chase each other to your heart's content, okay? <sighs> and it's also my birthday, just so you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mom! Mom! Mommy! 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 Mama! 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 Ma! Ma! Mama! Mama! What? Look what I can do. Puppies, what are you doing? Show the hair.
Number one. What's your name? You what? Wait. What? It's okay, it's okay. Number two, please. You say what? Wait. Singapore. Hey. Number three, please. What's your name? What? Jesus. What? Jesus Christ. <laughs> you only know what can come. <laughs> Number four, what's your name? Forget <laughs> what? Forget <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Hmm. Well, shit. When I'm done with you, your face will look like mashed potatoes. Yeah, whatever, man. Hello? Okay, I'm gonna go find that child, but then I'm gonna kill you. Okay, bye! Happy travels! <laughs> okay, let's see here. Nah! There was no child in there! Double check. Hi. I know you're messing with me. Where's that child? Where are you hiding it? Dude, I don't know. Just, um, uh, Freddy's behind you. Freddy? Hello! Hello, Freddy. Hi, Freddy! Hi, security guy! Freddy, don't talk to this guy, he's an asshole! Oh, profanity! Freddy, he's hiding a child somewhere and he won't show me where. Do you know what that means? We can't throw a birthday party, Freddy! No! Yes! We need to find him, Freddy! He wants birthday cake! I'll do my best, ma'am! Stop reading fanfics! They're confusing you! I'm starting to think there is no child. You just gotta look harder, man. That's it, fucker. I'm coming in there. Hello? But first, I'm gonna do one final check to make sure that child doesn't exist. <laughs> this job is a total joke. Who the fuck are you? Hello? <laughs> oh, this is my chance to catch him by surprise. Have at thee. Ah, oh, my fucking knees. Get crowbarred, bitch. Thanks for the crowbar, Foxy. Foxy, what the fuck? I don't know, I'm bored! Hey, Springtrap. What? Do you hear that? Oh, go fuck yourself. I got a club. Man, makes me wonder what else I don't know. Do you know you're supposed to work out your lower body, too? She knows that you need it. Make you cry, no point in hiding. She loves the sight, so in your eyes. What's that supposed to be about, baby? Cause we have your eyes that fat and crazy. Then minus on all the good times, baby. Try and put the gummy up to shady. What's that supposed to be about, baby? Cause we have your eyes. You gonna tell mom I was smoking? No, Mario. I'm not gonna tell. Yeah, you better not or I'll kick your ass. Anyway, just keep your mouth shut, scrote. Here come the guys. Sup, dude? Hey. Why'd you bring the kid? Cause my mom's a fucking idiot! So what's on the agenda? I'm supposed to get Peach out of Bowser's shithole, but I'm probably gonna blow it off. I don't give enough of a fuck today. You wanna jump the fence at the country club and use the pool? Ah, uh, we did that two days ago. You wanna go hang out at Cody's house? Oh, Cody is a piece of shit! I am so tired of that asshole! Come on, you guys, I don't wanna just fuck around today, you know? I wanna do something. Hey, you guys wanna see something really funny? I'm telling you, Scrote, the princess is down there. You gotta jump into the pit to save her. Are you sure about this, Samario? And guess what else, buddy? She told me she. Yeah, drop, drop, and roll. Do that. Do it like pro. Do that. Stop, drop, and roll. Do that. Do it like a pro. Do that. Tip top, rolly. What's up with you? You've been home for an hour. 
hour and a half. Not even once. Not one time have you tried to cuddle me. And it's pissing me the fuck off. I want my fucking cuddles. Come on, come on. What's this? No, 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 no. Radiant, carefree, dreamy, Adrian, the fragrance. Man, this look pretty good, man. Where your clothes at? Giggity, giggity. When I make dinner, nobody sees that. When I do the laundry, nobody sees that. When I do the dishes, nobody sees that. When I clean the house, Nobody sees that. But when I sit down to be on my phone, you're always on your phone. Which time you want, Bob? Afu? Yes. We are coming to your cup now. This is a come your cup, Labi. Your father. You know how once in a while your parents randomly drop the most interesting piece of lore about their lives out of nowhere? I've known you my whole life, and you're only just now telling me that you were a teenage underwear model in Hong Kong? Why didn't you lead with that? I thought you were just some middle-aged white guy who likes making sourdough bread. I literally only just learned that my dad used to sell knives, and he accidentally cut one of his fingers, went to the doctor to get it fixed, and ended up selling a set of knives to the doctor. Take notice of the unimpeded blood flow and clear view of the finger bone. Wow. You only get incredibly clean cuts like this with quality German G2 stainless steel sharpened at a 20% bevel for ideal cutting. This is paired with a full tank construction and an ergonomic handle. Wow, Throw in a lifetime right. warranty and this is a no-brainer. You can walk away with this very knife today. And if you get the full set, I'll throw in a 30% discount. Can't argue with that. You got a deal. Bae, I'm not in the mood. Please get away from me. Bae, where you going? Bae, 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 where you going? Bae, I was just playing. You, you were gonna leave me? You don't want me? I Pikachu, I choose you! Go! Pikachu! Pikachu, use Thunderbolt! Pika P! Big O! Venusaur, oh no! Counterattack with whatever you feel like, man! Wait, hold on, what? Ven I mean, Venusaur, with a question mark. Yeah, I don't know, whatever. Dude, come on, man! F fuck! I mean, Venusaur! I don't know what my fucking attacks are, dude. You're the one who keeps track of that shit. I just fucking take the hits for you. Pikachu, use a thunder smash! Pikachu! Ow, oh, fuck. Oh, God! Man, this is... I mean, Venusaur! Look, I don't care what you fucking do. I don't even know what Just say it? fucking Solar Beam! I mean, Venusaur! Whatever, do the solar beam. Yeah, okay, thanks! Venusaur! <laughs> Pikachu, while he's charging his thunder smash, use your bolt of lightning! Pikachu! Ah, ow! Okay, am I gonna do the thunder? Wait, well, I don't even need your permission for this one. I mean, <sighs> Venusaur. Ah! Oh, God, my fucking knee! That's my knee! Damn it! Shit! Oh, man! Why didn't you evolve me, you asshole? Because I love you, Pikachu! I Do don't you want like... me to lose? Is that what you want? Christ! <laughs> you all you feed me is puffins! I need nourishment! Tauros meat or something! We don't, we don't kill Pokemon! We do! We do it for you, you fucking assholes! God damn Look, it! Look, man, I'm, told, I'm, I'm really sorry about Fuck this. Fuck you, man! You suck! You stupid evolved prick! What do you even do? You just... You just a f plant? Shut up, man! It's all your fucking fault. Hey, I didn't you even... You were the one who was all, Oh, I gotta do an attack! Mm, you could've just walked away! But you didn't, you prick! So fuck you, you dumbass! Hello? 
Are you pooping? Hello? I know you're pooping. It smells good. <laughs> Any last words? I won't be shocked if this doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs>